has to be excited. So. Yeah, it does. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Welcome to Ahmad Farms, one of the most beautiful and calmest resorts here in Kuji, with a gorgeous landscape located at the outskirts of Abuja, a place that branches out from the typical Nigerian farm and provides hospitality, fun, tourism and lots more. It's a place to visit if you intend getting away from the busy city life, the hustle and bustle, you know what I mean. It's definitely a sight to behold. And so they've got this greenhouse that provides variety of vegetables that are supplied to supermarkets and other places at cheaper rates. on the 67.5 hectares of farmland. Okay. The farm has three major subcategories, the agricultural section, the hospitality section, and then the equestrian section. Okay. So for the agricultural section, we have, I'm sure we're coming to saw our greenhouses in there, yeah. or over there. Yeah. So in there, we cultivate crops like tomatoes, cucumbers, peppers, watermelon, sweet melon, carrots. Mm -hmm. And also we do cooking herbs such as broccoli, lettuce, Cabbage, pumpkin, and the likes, some of which are available for sale, okay. both in retail and then commercial. commercial. Then, still under agriculture, we are into pastoral farming, which is simply the cultivation of crops to be used as feed for livestock. So, then, lastly, we have the hospitality section where we have our lodges for okay. those who want to, you know, or spend some days or nights with us. And also, still under the hospitality section, we have the pet and zoo section where we have different kinds of animals like monkeys, tortoises, okay. ostriches, emus, antelopes. Mm -hmm. Uh, crocodiles and the likes, all of which you get to see and oh. interact with them as That's we go nice. along.
awesome. This is the one I can lift. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So how old is this for? This is 49 years old. 49. 49? Yes. Oh! <laughs> wow. Okay. Should I come in towards you? It's okay. Uh, it's okay. 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 It's nice. <laughs> <laughs> so what breed of fowl is this? So this is a Chinese breed of chicken. They are called silky chickens. As in silk. S I L K Y okay. or spelled as S I L K I E. Silky chickens from China okay. and they are named after their feathers. If you look at the feathers, it looks more like silk. Yeah. That's, That's why they are called silky chickens. Wow. So this one here is uh, a mini amphitheater. It's a multi-purpose area which we tend to be used for hosting conferences, exhibitions, and even also as a private seminar. The wine at the top, the top is also uh, also selling this because at the top here, due to there's a rooftop seat out there at the top, somewhere where you can just sit and you know yeah, have a view here and just yeah. enjoy the natural environment. So yeah. this is this thing under construction though. Yes, but you can see the I like it. Yeah, yeah. You look like it's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Look like Carlo. Very, very great view, unimpeded view of the natural environment. Yeah, okay. Which we use in Spain. So we are actually on our way to this place. Yeah. The Polo horse is from Argentina. Polo All the horses there are from are of Argentine descent. Oh. Yeah, so okay. they are here. So when we we'll get we we'll get a shot and we get to see them. This is actually one of our stables. Okay. Let's get to the other one. That's where the horse is. Okay. So this here is a stable here, an American size stable. Wow. So here the horses are kept there. Each horse is kept in a store and the name of the horse is written in the front of the store. So this the most is not in is out. Yeah, so you're going to see okay. yes. okay. yeah. yeah, it. Yes, Africana, yeah. Yeah, if you will. It's okay. a, yeah, it's a man. Then this is Mona. Mona. Hey Mona. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Let's see. She's interested. So, there you go. Hey, Mona. Touch the head. <laughs> hey, yeah. Mona. Is this a girl? Yeah, it's a man. It's a she. Oh. Yeah. Let me try some more. Yeah, you I should. I'm hungry. <laughs> hey, Mona. We actually have a promo team here for our team, our mat team. Our mat team. Okay. So we attend tournaments nationwide. And so this is the part of where the horses come to you know, okay. play and then graze. We are trying to recreate their natural environment okay. as okay. much as we can. So okay. you can see them over there in groups okay. grazing freely, yeah. unaided, undisturbed. Yeah. Okay. So over there across the river, the green area, that's the promo team. Then we have promo training for also. Yeah, this is an emu. They are emu. from yeah, emu, e -M -U, emus. Oh. Yeah, they are from the same families as ostriches, and they are endemic to Australia. 
So okay. we brought these ones in from Australia. Okay. Yeah. And the emus are not switches have three major physical differences. Okay. Ostriches are quite taller, taller. Yeah, compared to emus. Yeah. And ostriches have two toes as against emus who have just two toes on. Oh no, ostriches have two toes. While emus have three toes on their feet. Yeah, while ostriches have a brown skin, while emus have a pale blue or black skin. Yeah. yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 